Welcome back to the Kaboom Guy! Ha! We're back! Uh, we are back. Out. Cal. What was that? Oh, hey! How are you? What's happening? Was that a call? I think there so. A few of them just fly by right, flew by right now. California sun is back at full power and we're back at the compound as well. What do we shoot today? Do we have anything left to shoot? I think you got some. Oh, we found something. We have 16 gauge metals. Um, still, they are pretty thick actually. And the plan that we have for these guys, it's pretty simple. Let's just keep shooting them. Keep shooting them to see what happens. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, <laughs> 16 of them. I kind of forgot that I have this long boy. It was hiding in one of my... <laughs> yep, I know, I know. Where is she? I can't see. Is that uh, Stacy talking or it's the, uh, the bird singing for us? Uh, I think we it's have a live be singer as well today. Yep, yep, good job, good job. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna start with the 22 long rifle with the long rifle or long pistol or long revolver, whatever you want to call it. Uh, let's go ahead and kaboom the GoPro. There we go. The dude is recording. Eyes and ears. Beautiful. Let me just make sure that we have a good shot here. Stacy, by the way, Stacy is gonna stay there and he's, she's gonna make sure that everything goes all right. There is the singer running around. It's right behind that tree. Anyways, we have, we have company today. <laughs> Let's get loaded up. Oh, by the way, this is um, Heritage, right? If I'm, yeah, Rough Rider Heritage, 16 inch barrel. It's almost a rifle. Let's go ahead and do some kaboom. Let's see if we are lined up. Yes, we are. You ready? Ready. Eyes and ears. Kaboom, kaboom. Ah, oh, we're close. Let's step back a little bit. <laughs> kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. <laughs> Perfect shot in the middle. I don't see a hole, if you know what I mean. Good that we step back a little bit. She's awesome. <laughs> right there, as you can see. And it did not even go through the first one. All right, time to use this beautiful Barsa. It shoots a 380. It's a magazine fed, obviously, right there. Um, does have a safety. And for comparison, come close. That is the 380, and this is a 9mm. So I would say it's right between the 22, uh, it's, I mean, a triple size of the 22 long rifle, but a little bit smaller than 9mm. It is, what, what it is? It is what, what, what? It is a 95 grain. That goes there, that goes here, eyes and ears. Do we? Step forward or stay here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and shoot this 380. It's go to a rolling. Yes, it is. Kaboom, kaboom, and kaboom. Nice shot. Let's see what happened. We, we are clear. Dude, I'm glad that we had this. We have this win, or else we will, we will. He would be cooking. Oh, didn't go through. Oh, these guys are tough, huh? Look. So that's that was our 22. Okay. That's our 380. I was trying. As to. you can see, all oh, it was far, far from <laughs> penetrating. If you know what I mean. We're gonna gra grab a full metal jacket, which is, which is 115 grain. We have this beautiful Glock, thanks to Precise Armory, that we have a nice trigger in there, Timney trigger. We have an engraving that says range day, which is a range day here. And if you remember, if you're one of those uh, loyal, solid subscribers that you followed me from the beginning, the channel name used to be a range day. So that's how we have this here. And then, well, Let's go ahead and shoot it with the beautiful Glock 19. 
What do you think? I think it's definitely going through the first one and might even go through the second one. Well, let's find out. Time for a kaboom! Did I load one in there? <laughs> <laughs> kaboom, kaboom, uh, kaboom! Nice shot, went through, I can tell. Am I yelling? Oh, just the first one. No way. Went through the first one. Hit our second one. And not much power behind it. What is this? Is that the nine? Yeah, it's hot. Dude, how... F it looks like you polished it. The lead looks like a steel, dude. Can this be part of this though? No. Maybe. Well, as you saw, 9mm went through and I, to be honest, I was thinking it's going to go out at least through two, maybe stop on the third one. But it just barely made it through the first one. What do we step it up to? 40 or 40? let's go to 45. Time for the 40 cal. It's 180 grain, full metal jacket. Stacy, are you watching this good? Yeah? Oh, he's gonna shoot it since he's, he loves this army guy. We named the pistol army guy since it's army green army basically. Uh, here you go. Is it still recording? The worst cameraman is in action. Is it already loaded? Or no, you have to chamber one. Let's see, yeah, everything is good here. Eyes and ears. Ear protection, beautiful. Let me hide right behind you. Let's see if you can Let shoot me. it. Don't rush, don't rush. Kaboom. Come on, good job. Good job. You are clear. He did a great job. No! Look! Wow! Dude, look the way that he deformed it. So as you can see, the power behind that was very good, but penetration-wise... Speed-wise? Speed does better, which is the 9mm. So again, that was our 22, that was our 380, that's our 9mm, and that's our 40. Let's keep this here and shoot it with the 45 as well, and let's see what happens. For the 45, we have... Rock Island takes a bad boy. Those bad boys are pretty fat. Again, for you guys who don't know, I'm gonna have to show you a comparison. Here we go. So, 380, 9mm, 40, and 45. You see it's pretty fat, huh? You like it fat? Yeah, yeah. Well, the good ways, I mean. The good ways, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Eyes and ears. This all right, I'm gonna be on this side. Is all metal, has a safety, but we can activate the safety when it's cocked. Clear, GoPro. I think, I mean, it's slower than the 40, but it's pretty heavy. So, well, let's find out. Cocked and loaded, kaboom, kaboom. <laughs> Every time! Kaboom! Kaboom! <laughs> wow! <laughs> oh, we clear? We're actually pretty close for this stuff that it doesn't go through. It didn't, dude. If we hit right next to the 9, even though he had better chance of penetrating since there was a nine hole compromised part right here, we managed to close up the nine, but not go through. So winner of these few calibers, what do we do? Oh, we broke the table. I mean, that's the difference, see? It's heavy. It's pretty it heavy, but it's not tiny enough and fast enough to do its job. If, Anyways, let's not get too serious about that. <laughs> yeah, This one is bent too. Looks like a blood, dude. Anyway, so what do we have pistol-wise? We shot the 45, we, had, we have the 500 speed of Wesson. But I'm afraid if I shoot that, it's gonna destroy this. 
that, the table, maybe the GoPro, everything. <laughs> so we'll keep that when we move to rifles. All right, our GoPro is rolling. Now we're gonna start with this beautiful Spike Tactical AR-15, which shoots a 5.56. I love this rifle. And 5.56 is basically the smallest round uh, rifle that I have. And that doesn't mean this guy can't do stuff. This guy can do a lot of stuff. Let's see what he can do. So the most penetration that we had, it was the nine millimeter, which went through only one. What do you think? I'm gonna say four of them. I would say three. Three or four. Let's find out. We are locked and loaded. It's time for the five, five, six to say kaboom, kaboom, uh, kaboom. I don't even see the hole. I shot a little bit low, I guess. We are clear. Let's see what happened here. I shot pretty low, actually. Maybe it goes through the wood. Let me come from this side. So that's our one. That's our number two. In and out. That's our number three. In and out. So you can see it's tearing apart. You can see all these scratches over. So that projectile is tearing apart. If if that's in the body, all those pieces are not good. Uh -uh. That's our fourth. See how big the hole got? If you know what. I mean. <laughs> That's our fifth, right there. No and then we guess. hit our sixth, right? The one to, yeah, hit our sixth right there. And just pretty much had just a little bit of power to bend, not bent it, but have a just little a bit of a ding or ding or ding or bing, something like that. I don't see any projectiles. That thing just torn to pieces. What do we have after this? 300 blackout. Gun. Oh, no. 300 blackout. All right, for comparison, that, that was the 5.56 that we shot. This is a 7.62 by 39, which an AK-47 shoots. Right between them is this bad boy, which is a 300 blackout. It is about 145 grain, if I'm not mistaken. Gotta check, right? Well, I'll, I'll, I'll write it down there, right there, if you can, so you can see it. We have another beautiful AR-15, which is a stag arm. Um, I had this for a long time. I told you guys a thousand times already. California. There we go. There is this full metal jacket bad boy. What do you think? I think it's going to do less damage than 5.56. Five, this, this guy's going to be four. Four? Yeah, four. Yeah, you're right. Four or five. The other one stopped at six, five, five, six, six right? We are locked and loaded. Let's do some uh, kabooms. Kabooms. Uh, kabooms right in the middle. We are clear. We did not activate the GoPro. But it's okay. That's the same thing that happens every time. Is it recording? No, it's not. All right, come to us. Little show. <laughs> That's our entry hole. Out, in and out. Oh, look at the difference between the 556 five, and the 300 blackout. That's our fort. He opened it up pretty nice. It's like a cap right here. Damn, that's big. That's it, Ram. Yep, yep. So one less than the 556. Five, six. six, this one, Fifth one. Uh, went through four. Hit the fifth and stopped, but five five six went through the fifth as well and hit the sixth. So I think it's time for the seven, seven six two by thirty nine. Let's set this up back. Well, this is a good target, huh? It stops a lot of bullets. What it is, is, what's, yeah. what's going on with this guy? Our seven six two by thirty nine and our K I K I K I I I K forty seven that has this. You shoot it. <laughs> Let me load it up for you. Just have to chamber one in there. Let, let me start my beautiful camera work. There we go here. 
We're recording. Oh, uh, wait a second. Point it that way. It's not loaded, but just in case, let me get the ro GoPro lo rolling this time. Uh, All right, we're locked and loaded and ready to go. Can you hit it? I'll I try. think you can. Time for some kabooms. Ooh. Nice shot. Nice shot. Beautiful shot. What? What's happening, Gish? So, what's going on? That's our 762 by 39. Obviously, bigger hole than the 300. No, it's this one. Which one was the 300? <laughs> It's using the same, the same hole. hole. You have to shoot Look. it again, huh? Look. <laughs> Not the same hole, but it's the same hole. If... So did exactly like what seven six uh, what five five six did, but five five six did dent a little bit. Seven six two did a little and more. A bit that's more. why it was using the other kind of. It was using the other hole at some point. Uh, well, it's not good to use the same hole at some point, but I mean, it's good actually. I don't know. <laughs> Stop talking. <laughs> uh, now we're gonna go ahead and what do we have after this? 762. After we we are going to 762 by 34 or or 38. Let's go with the 38 first, dude. We have a lot of um, calibers to shoot. <laughs> Now it's time for a 308. Comparison wise, again, that is a 556 five, or 223. Two, this is a 556, five, but 223 two, looks the same. Uh, and this is the 308. We're going to use this bolt action Remington 873, if I'm not mistaken, 783. Close enough. This is a pretty cheap, not cheap, I mean, cheap is financial wise cheap. It doesn't cost anything. And it's a great hunting uh, bolt action rifle. It shoots a pretty big boy if I can get loaded up. Let's go ahead and do the GoPro. I think this guy is gonna penetrate the six, six stop seven, seven, and stop at eight. Maybe. I'm gonna say stop at seven. Maybe seven, you're right. And then uh, I removed one of the sheets, which was very damaged. So, just for your information, are you ready? Ready. Eyes and ears. 308 is going to tell me! Kaboom! Ooh. <laughs> we are clear! That was a lot of movement there. Don't you think? I mean, I didn't see I was looking at the camera. You should look at the target. <laughs> Stacy, what happened here? Oh my! I think this is our first one. That's the hole. It's, they love to use the same hole, I guess. <laughs> that's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's six. Stopped at seven. Oh, so nice. we're, we're pretty accurate, huh? Two more, right? Two more. They passed the fifth, hit the sixth. This passed the sixth, hit the seventh. So pretty much one more. Yeah. Five to six, six to seven. Yeah, just one more. One. one more time. Oh, no, not not shooting that one more time. We're gonna move to a seven six two by fifty four or I don't know. I'm already mixing up my calibers. So unfortunately, I just came to a realization, real that I forgot to bring um, um, rounds for the seven six two by fifty four R. Now we're gonna skip that and go to a 30 out six. Uh, this 30 out six is about 165 grain. We're gonna use this beautiful Hawa. It's a model 1500. Thanks to Precise Armory for letting me use this beautiful. What do you think is gonna happen with this guy? Let's find out. Eyes and ears, everyone, because the 30 out six is about to make some noise. Why am I yelling? <laughs> All right, 30 out six, make your noise. We shoot on the top, I guess. Kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. Stacy is down. <laughs> Poor Stacy. 
What are, did they shoot the stairs? <laughs> what happened to her? I think she moved from the vibration of Let me the show table. Stacy first. Stacy, come on. Come on, girl. You asked to be there. No, me, no, she's not shot. She's all right. You're, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're back. Whew. That's our shot right there. One, two. Use the same hole again. Three, four, five. Did not go through. Six and seven, huh? Six, seven. Damn. That's a hard hit. So pretty much did the same as the 308, but the hit was much harder. Damn. That's a big hit right there. We have one more round. And we're gonna go ahead and wrap this up, and that round will be an eight millimeter. All right, so here is the plan. Why am I not using this brand new ones? Because I have a little bit of a plan, and I'm hoping they're gonna survive. So I'm gonna try to shoot it here, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them here, and then the ninth is completely undamaged, and um, it's. I don't want to say it's not going to go through because 8mm does stuff that I have never seen before. Alright. This guy's beautiful. Shoots this giant bullet. I'm going to put one in here. We're going to load it up. We're going to put the eyes in here. So what do you think? The last oh. <laughs> was 7 6. Um, it was the 30 out 30 six, out which six. didn't go through the seventh, right? It went yeah, through the six, hit seven. the seventh. I think this is definitely gonna go through the seventh and might stop at eight, which I'm is which that would make sense. Eight millimeter? Nine. What? Nine? It's possible. But if it stops at eight, that's beautiful because it's it an is. eight millimeter, you know? If that makes any difference. So it's for sake of a kaboom and now I have to hit that top part? Okay. Kaboom! Kaboom! Did I hit where I wanted to hit? Kind of! <laughs> We're clear! Yeah. Did I shoot a little bit low? Yeah. Same side but low. So I didn't even know what I had here. I think one of them flew away, right? Yeah. yeah. The first one. No, that wasn't the first one. The first one is here. Did I shoot here? Yeah. Or this one. This one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the one. That's the one, yeah. So, goes right there. Goes right here. Two. Three. Four. <laughs> yep. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Eight millimeter. Nothing here. This is like part of those stuff that are hitting it. So that's the winner of this contest. That beautiful eight millimeter killed them all. Killed eight, eight of these. 16 gauge. These are, I was trying to straight one of them. If you know what I mean. With the axe. These things are tough, dude. Look. I can't even bend it. I'm about 210 pounds and this guy is not moving at all. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you.